All right, Micah, as far as this team goes, I know it's I know it's day one, but what have you seen from this team that you like? What are going to be some of the strengths of this Mad Ants team as we head into a new season? So far, the leadership uh, starts uh, with our GM, of course, and down to our coach, Coach H. And uh, I think that that's the biggest thing about this team that I really like. Our leadership is very strong from the veteran players, and uh, they're helping out the younger guys at camp. For you, um, what's the biggest key for you to not only assimilate in this team, but uh, to kind of stand out and be able to uh, maybe put your stamp on this team and show scouts what you have? Um, it's just more so just learn how to run a team. You know, that's what I'm here for is learn how to run a team and also um, take care of the basketball, do what a point guard does. You know, in the next level, they look for their point guard to take care of the ball, run their team, and I'm just trying to show that I could do that and uh, pick Coach H's brain as much as I can while I'm here and try and learn as much uh, about the game of basketball. You guys are about uh, a week and a half away from your first game on the 15th, so uh, given that amount of time, what do you guys have to do over the next 10, 12 days to get ready for that first game? More so we have to gel, continue to gel as a team. Um, we're learning the offense. Some guys are still trying to pick it up. Some guys are, are picking it up quick. Some guys not so quick. So, I mean, in the span of a week and a half, it's so short. But um, them two days are really helping us out and learn the plays and learn how to play with each other. And then um, as the games gradually get, you know, down to December 1st, I think we'll be a lot more better than we are, you know, uh, November 15th. But it's, it's also it's all about getting better and progressing as the season goes. Yeah, for you, a guy highly touted when you signed with the University of Texas, had a, had a nice but brief career there. Um, what do you take away from your time at Texas that you can apply as a professional athlete? Now? I'm just being an everyday guy, you know, bringing it every day, you know, practice when no one's around because um, you can't just turn it on. You know, it's not an on and off switch. you got to have it on all the time. So that's something that I've learned at being at a high university like the uh, University of Texas, a high-profile university, and just bringing it here, showing guys how to work that probably thought they were working before. Um, they, they really weren't. So it's just about um, bringing that attitude and that mentality to this team.